Howdy. Hello there, one and all. Um, shit, what is it doing? What's my game doing? Okay. Uh, what is this going? Got, uh, Metal Gear is a nice change of pace. I do agree. Nut. <laughs> Ayo. What's going on, Video Gamer? What's going on, No Names? What's going on, Toxic? How are y'all doing? I see you guys are just shit posting it up as usual. I'm used to it at this point. Welcome to the Monday edition of the Speed Mobile live stream. I'm not really... <laughs> Yo, Angelo. <laughs> it just I need to make a, a bump where it's just a rock. Gotta say hi to pass. I'll just have it in the corner, and then you just say yo to it whenever I do something stupid or good. Doesn't matter. But what I'm trying to what I'm trying to figure out is is that I want to make Mondays kind of like a variety thing. I don't know what it would be, but it'll be like maybe a random game or something. I don't know. But right now, uh, Majora's Mask is the main focus, but. We're, you know, trying to figure that out, so hopefully I go to the game, and it'll be working? Hold on, I gotta close that. And game. There it is. Look at that. Alright, let's play it. Launching. Time to die. Oh, shit. I forgot to... Shit. 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 Oh no, I, I did lower it. I can raise it up just a bit, like right around there. Hopefully that's good. Yeah, it should be. We're good. There it is. Just let me know if my audio is okay compared to the video because Again, I don't want to kind of shit it up, you know? As I, this is the first time I'm playing a game like this on uh, my stream, so... Hopefully it won't come in too shitty. Oh, look at that. No joke. Uh, this is probably my favorite incarnation of Snake. I mean, I like three, and maybe, like, you know what was going on in the Peace Walker stuff. Maybe not so much, I still have to play them, but... Anyway, let's hop right into this. I'm hoping that my controls aren't as bad, but you know what I'm saying. I gotta move all my shit out of the way. Uh, all this garbage, no place to put it. Okay, so... You should play games with your viewers every once in a while if you want to change things up. That would be cool. Because what I want to do is... Because you know how we all like pop in the chat and we just like talk to each other and whatnot? Yeah, I like doing that. But the thing is, is that I feel like whenever I do do it, I can't get the volumes right. And I sometimes have it, you know, adjusted to where I do remember and sometimes I don't. But... Um, I want to set up a day where I can do that. That could be a thing where I just play games with the viewers. I still got Smash Ultimate. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. Um, maybe I might even make that what tomorrow might be. Because I was thinking about making tomorrow a drawing stream, but I still haven't figured out... I still haven't figured out, you know, how to work that, you know? So, um... <clears throat> Rebel come. <laughs> you forgot an S there, Buck. Forgot the S there. Alright, so we're just gonna continue. Crap. So is my voice okay with the game? Is it too low? Is it I think it's too high, but I hope that it's not too bad. Unit function added. Alright, what am I doing? Okay, there's that. How do I switch weapons? Uh, how do I switch weapons? How do I... Okay. Uh, okay. Oh my god, I gotta remember how to play the game. You're good? Okay. I forgot. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you forgot. Okay, so that's crouch. I, I remember that. How do I trigger my weapons? How do I trigger my weapons? 
Okay, how do I look at my weapons? Can I lower? Can I... Can I... How do I... For the love of God, man! Okay, here we go. Okay, so we got that. Can I... No? Okay. Alright. Also, is the game coming in okay? Is it looking good? Is it pixely or anything? Here, let me... Hold on. Let me... Ugh. You can always just go to your control settings. Yeah, I know, but like I played it the normal way, if that makes sense. Oh yeah, that looks really good. Oh, okay. Yeah, that looks... I... Oh yeah, that looks fine. I don't know what I was worried about. Okay, uh, what's my E button? Uh, it's good. Okay, that's good. Cause I remember. Oh, jeez, snake. Oh. All right. So I think that. Okay, I think I got a. Uh. There we go. Marker placed. What are my objectives? What is my mission? E horse. Delivery point. Oh, I already got that. Where am I going? Am I no, I'm not doing any mission? Oh, I have to go over here. Marker placed. Okay. Um <laughs> You know what? Wonder what these guys are talking about. Hey, want to see me? Want to see me watch the watch me end this guy's whole career? Hey guys. Okay. Got him. All right, let's get on a moving. I might have just killed. Oh, that's sad. I don't have the resources to do that yet. Okay, cool. That's right. I'm so used to doing that. Toodles. Oh, I'm sorry, Bucko. Oh, give me that. Give me that biological materials. Skills, epic gamer, MLG, yeah. Where? Oh, look at that diamond. Those are raw diamonds. Collecting them as assets will raise our GMP. Good job, boss. Good job just finding shit on the ground. All right. Uh, I didn't mean to do that. Okay. There it is. Get on. Man, I have no idea where I'm going. Okay, so horse game. I'm not very good with this still, so. Ugh. It's not like Red Dead physics, though. So give me some time to get used to the game again, you know? Get my roots back in in place. I used to be really decent at this game. I was playing some uh uh what do you call it, you know? Oh. Camp. All right. We're at a camp. We're just going to hone our skills. Well, oh, that's a big camp. Um that's a big boy camp. I, I don't know. I don't know if I can get through this. Let me think. Let me think. What is my... Is my horse right behind? 
right there. Keep going. Okay. E? Was oh, it because I don't have a scope? Can't I go in like first person? You can disrupt communications between oh, okay. the outposts by destroying comms equipment. That'll prevent one post from sending reinforcements to another. Can I just not look down the sights? Destroying the power system will shut it. down the local electrical grid. That'll give you a leg up when operating in the dark. Is that a truck? Oh, okay. Oh, we're gonna sneak in there. Yoink! Okay, uh... They'll take me closer. Now we're gonna sneak on out of here. Where am I gonna get this? Um. Uh, boy, what am I doing? Um. Get out of the box. None. Okay. No, get in the car. All right. We're driving. Yeah, I know what I'm doing. Look at that. Your Amazon snake has arrived pretty much. <laughs> that was on Amazon Prime. I just can you extract some back here? Oh, I just extracted one of them. <laughs> I'll mail I'll fucking Amazon Prime that shit to ya. <laughs> oh, is this another base? Oh boy. Hey guys. Doodles. See I'm a good I'm a good boss. I'm a good boss. They're calling my heroism down by Fuck that. I'm on I'm on a duty right now. I ain't got no time to deal with that shit. Oh, drift mode. Hey, we're doing pretty good right now. I'm I'm really happy about that. Kind of sucks that they have all these bases around, but you know what? It's okay because we're saving on that time. We're almost there too. Look, look, we're almost there. Whoa! Oh my God! Okay, back it up. Drive it forward. Keep it going. Oh, jeez. Oh, fuck! Oh, can you jump it? Ah, oh, fuck, snake. Come on. Oh, it's on the other side. Oh, my God. Oh, extract the highly skilled soldier. Oh, that's not highly skilled. No! Boss, come in. 
Boss? Boss! <laughs> oh, that ain't Scoob. That ain't Scoob. We're okay, though. <sighs> hey, we got our car back. We're still good. <clears throat> So we got to extract the highly skilled soldier somewhere over there. Um, come on, snake. Good. We got to be sneaky with this car. We got to be hella sneaky. We got to sneak this into the base without fucking too much shit up. Come on. Come on now. Okay. We're extracting the highly. Oh, that ain't. Really? They can't hit me. They can't fucking hit me. They can't hit what they can't see. Boss, get down. The enemy sniper. Oh, no. He's a drunk driver. Oh, fuck. Oh. Come on, baby. Look at that park job, though. Look at that park job. Speed, what are your thoughts on Minecraft? That would be really... Fun stream. You know, I never got into it, but I guess I've just never really been introduced to it well enough. Why? Can I go get it? Can I get the Minecraft? Should I go get it? Alright. So, I'm gonna do something real quick. I'm gonna... Whoa, that guy. Uh, buddy. Yeah, I'm gonna have to ask you to leave. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna have to ask that guy to leave. It'd definitely be worth the price, you think so? Yeah, I think it'd be good. I'll give it a try. Why not? I'll look into it. How's that sound? Also, this guy. Okay, how do I fucking... There's gotta be control. No. Controls. Uh... That's not it. Wait, no, okay. Okay. All right, I know what I got it. I got it. Alright guys, I had to get the I couldn't Alright Yeah, okay There's sheep around With the local residents gone They've gone back to the wild 
Okay. Um. Speed with the jokes. I need that guy to leave. <laughs> yeah. I, yeah, it was. He, he kind of left. Sorry, I had to go find a controller. Uh, I'm playing with a controller now. It feels so much better. I don't know why I'm not zooming down the barrel, though. I know I can do that. Can I do it? How do I, and how do I zoom down the barrel? I know that there was a way to do it. I know there was a way. Uh, there it is. All right, so this guy is gonna have an early retirement right around there. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, are you okay? Look at I kind of pooped a little blood, so. Speed is a boomer. I'm not a boomer. I am anything but. I'm a funny, funny, mean guy. Alright, I think I can destroy this bridge. want to say I can Doodles Be like what the hell was that? Yeah, I got to actually get someone though. So your suppressor is worn out. That gun will be as loud as any other now. If you have to shoot, be careful. No, don't agree with that. I am not a boomer. Now, this is going to be a boomer. Watch this shit. I'm about to end this man's whole career. I need to figure out where this soldier is. That was such a boomer joke. You're just mad because you aren't a smart enough to make these kind of jokes. You're you don't watch enough Rick and Morty to truly understand the high IQ that I possess. Like you guys need to get your guys' shit checked. Look, I don't even care. I'm going in with open gunfire. I don't even give a shit. I'm going in with open gunfire. And all these guys can do is just stand and watch. Like this guy right here. Get down here.
Oh, you see their fear right before I shoot them. Oh my gosh. All right, where in this fucking... Oh, I'm not even in the right... I'm not even in the right base? Ah, f God damn it. I'm not even doing the right mission. Okay. Hey, guys. Anybody got a beer? You got a beer. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, hey. Hey, look at this guy. Uh. Uh. Okay, come on guys All right, this is what what do you want? Uh. Like, I don't know where this guy is <laughs> Yeah, I'm just casually walking at this point. Uh, where's my weapons? There we go. Toodles. Can this thing seriously just explode? Thanks. There it goes. All right, I'm dipping. No. Uh. Boomer. I'm not a fucking boomer. God. God. You guys are. Wow, you guys will have no families to go home to. Neither will you, you, and especially not you. Okay. Yeah, I missed. I don't care. I'm out of ammo. No, I'm not. I'm still good. We're still gold. We're still YouTube gold. Here we go. Let me get this minor metal. Snake secretly is able to fit three dildos up his ass at once and it keeps him with him within the field. Hey, you gotta you gotta know how to survive. Snake is the ultimate tactical survivalist. Alright, give me that. Man, Snake just took a boatload of bullets and is just walking it off, grabbing minerals for Mother Base. Oh, that's a secret way. Hey, where's everyone else? Oh, you see me? guys are you guys got to try harder than that here here I'll let you guys off with a warning okay buddy bye <laughs> oh this is great I, I forget how fun this game is Snake, that was a good job. Good job, Snake. Oh, 
Oh, I hear a song. An air conditioner? What am I doing with that? Nothing. That's what I'm doing. Taking that. Jimmy Changa is Mexican Jimmy Neutron. <laughs> it, I don't know how to answer that. I thought it was Chimmy Changa, not Jimmy Janga Changa. Hopping. Uh, I can go this way. Actually, I'm going this way. Oh, I gotta break the lock? Come on. Oh, right. This is where a prisoner would be. Wait, that's really what it is? It's... Jimmy John Changa, not Chimmy Changa, or is it? I don't know. Also, I gotta poop. See ya. Toilet. If you're gonna hide inside, watch the enemy doesn't decide to use it. Same goes for hiding downed enemies in it. Ah, the good old, the good old meme safe. Out of ammo. Let the support unit help out if you need to restock. Transmit a request from your iDroid and I'll send supplies right away. Oh, I can't even do that. Okay. Okay, Dad, bye. You should get Minecraft. Okay. See ya, Toxic. Ugh. I have to go through both? Got it. And look at all this mineral shit I'm getting. Ah, uh, yes, the lone traffic cone. Give me that fuel. I don't even know where else I have to go in this point. I have to go to that other place and extract that dude. I should go and get better. Eh, I could probably do this. Um, let me get in a vehicle. We kind of snuck some shit too, so... Is that a diamond? Did I see a diamond? No. Yes, I did. We're driving. So we're going to the base next door, I believe.
Oh, that was close. Oh, I took a wrong turn. Wait, am I in the mission area, right? What's going on? Oh my god, what's going on? Ah, oh, snake! Well... I guess I can't drive it? What? Okay, I guess I can't. Let's go. You have arrived at your destination. Okay, I turned a helicopter. Guess it's just not letting me do the mission? I don't know what's going on. Alright, well, I got my footing in, so I should be okay. Okay. Side ops list updated. Ocelot's briefing. You were hospitalized in Dekelia, a British sovereign base area on Cyprus. It's part of British overseas territory that falls outside of Cypriot jurisdiction. You got moved from Cuba's little America right into Cyprus's little Britain. Why Dekelia? The UK and the US remain close allies. The last place Cypher would think to look for you is inside their own system. That's what kept you safe in British Military Hospital for nine years. The safest place from a whale is inside its own belly. You were a regular Geppetto. Well, it wasn't Pinocchio who led me out to safety. So who was that guy? Cypher went so far as to attack British territory, burning their own ally. That's how badly they wanted you dead. He said I was in a British Military Hospital. But the doctor had a Greek accent. They hire locally. Easier to trust them. The Kelly is also home to Greek Cypriots, after all. What about the Turks? They haven't returned to the south. Not yet. The Cyprus dispute is still a long way from resolved. The country is just as split as it was in 74. Turkish Cypriots in the north, Greek Cypriots in the south. And between them, the Green Line, the UN, established. And the Kelia sits right on top of it. It does part of the buffer zone between the two groups. Another reason it was the perfect place to hide you. Easy to spot any outsiders snooping around. So how do things stand? Now, last year, the Turks declared that the Turkish Republic of Northern Cyprus is an independent state, though it's only Turkey that recognizes it. In the past, the Greeks and Turks lived side by side in the same villages. There are reasons to fight. Those came from the outside. Greece, Turkey, Britain, America. They all had their own stake in pitting the two sides against each other. But once you spark something like this, it's impossible to control. Both sides build up grudges like death, without the foresight to see that each act of revenge just fans the flames, and then it's too late for other nations to rush in with peace talks. The embers keep on smoldering. Each nation's arrogance only breeds anarchy. The world is paralyzed by this hunger for revenge. Cyprus is no different. sailing the Suez in a whaler, the Suez Canal. When did they reopen it? Not long after you were attacked. Once they finished sweeping it for mines after the Arab-Israeli conflict. 
Can you stand? We've got to transfer to a container ship for passage through the Suez. Our destination is Pakistan, Afghanistan's neighbor to the south. There we disembark and head via Peshawar to the Zero Line, the border. We'll travel to the Khyber Pass by road. And then we continue on horseback. Afghanistan's main roads are under Soviet control. We'll need to go around them. It'll be all narrow, winding paths through the mountains. We'll do better on horseback. It's a local guerrilla tactic. They use the higher ridges to avoid air recons. Then they charge down the mountains for ambushes. The Soviets still haven't devised a counter strategy. Our time frame is only half as much as we really need. It's gonna be a tough march. Better horses than boats. Well, it'll make for good physiotherapy. Take the time to get used to that new arm. While the Soviets have indicated they are not participating in the Los Angeles Olympics, primarily because the United States has made no attempt to guarantee the safety of the Soviet Union's athletes, the United States is increasingly demonstrating the belief that the issue has nothing to do with its preparations, and in fact this is retaliation for the Western nation's boycott of the previous Moscow Olympics. That concludes today's news. That's quite some news. The uh, Soviet Union not attending the LA Olympics? Yeah. Andropov's death has changed some things. They're calling it revenge for the Western boycott of the Moscow Olympics. The country's boycotted the Moscow Olympics? Yes. In protest of the Soviet Union's invasion of Afghanistan. Over 50 countries were absent. It's too bad I didn't get to see Yamashita's judo. When the 40th Army crossed the Amu River four years ago, detente went right out the window. The U.S. Congress chose not to ratify SALT II, and Reagan's hardline politics won in the presidency in a landslide. According to him, the Soviet Union's an evil empire. <laughs> the Second Cold War. And there's been no end to regional conflicts and civil wars. Lebanon, the Falklands, Grenada, Iran, Iraq. The story never changes. Egypt and Israel did sign a peace treaty. But then the driving force on the Egyptian side, President Sadat, was assassinated afterward. Apparently, his actions were considered a betrayal of his fellow Arabs. Islamic extremists? Yes. Fundamentalist extremists have been responsible for some bold acts of terrorism in recent years. We've had extremist students in Iran take U.S. embassy workers hostage and suicide bombings in Lebanon. Over 300 foreign soldiers stationed there have been killed. Countries have yet to develop an effective means of dealing with terrorism. Afraid of losing their own men, they pulled their forces out, handing private forces a golden opportunity. Private forces? Small armies with no national affiliation, working for the highest bidder. That's right, they got the idea from you. After Mother Base went down, they began spreading to meet the soaring demand. Miller's organization is just one of many PFs now. The entire world is after you. But at the same time, it needs you to. Miller told me about what happened in the Caribbean nine years ago. You do remember Miller. You'd formed a private army with him. An army with no allegiance to a nation. I remember, but... I see. You're not sure what's fact and what's a fantasy caused by the coma. It's still all a mess, huh? All I can do is tell you the facts as they were told to me. I've gone easy on you up until now. But this is where the hard stuff begins. 1974, the year before you entered your coma. You were in Colombia, operating with a small unit of men, basically mercenaries. Miller was among them. Miller was trying to find a way to turn his and your talents into a line of work. He was looking to start a business where you would fight on behalf of others around the world, those who needed military force. But the reality was, at that time, you didn't have enough gear to equip your own men. Then Miller came across this client, it was a huge job he was offering, but you had a shot at pulling it off. You accepted it and headed into Costa Rica. The client even threw in an offshore facility in the Caribbean. The mother base. That would be your new base of operations. Miller sure did have a head for business. As your mission went on, your unit grew and grew. More weapons, more money. Before you knew it, you were commanding 300 men. As the organization got bigger, your military power swelled to match. It got so the international community couldn't afford to ignore you. You were just too damn successful for your own good. You, your men, had worn out your welcome. Everyone was out for you. 
East, West, First World, Third. It was only a matter of time before someone took you down. And that was XOF. Officially, they're an anti-terror unit under the CIA. In reality, they're Cypher's private strike force. They lured you to Cuba using Chico, the Nicaraguan revolutionary kid, and Paz, a mole who worked for Cypher as bait. While you were gone, XOF, posing as a nuclear inspection team, stormed Mother Base. At the same time, C4 they placed on the strut legs went off. The whole thing went down in minutes. XOF. Kisses and hugs followed by a big F you. All because of Miller's blind spot. A back door into Mother Base no one suspected. You remember a certain scientist. Huey was responsible for bringing the inspection team on board. Giving the enemy a perfect opportunity to hit you at home. You were returning from Cuba when it happened. Mother Base came damn close to taking you with it into the Caribbean. Those of your men out on assignment returned right away. They refused to believe the wreckage in the water they found was Mother Base. But they checked the coordinates again and again. Until reality finally settled in. You were supposed to die that day. That was XOF's primary objective. As far as most folks know, you did. The first doctor to see you wasn't even sure what he was looking at. Before they'd even finished operating, your men moved you to that hospital in Cyprus. It was a woman named Eva who arranged that. Rings a bell, hmm? Most men in your condition would have been written off right from the start. But you survived. You went straight down to hell, and they pulled you out. Your eye wide open. Full of venom. The days of naked snake are long gone. Welcome back, venom snake. This world still needs you. Your snake, try this on. A prosthetic arm. Yeah, Miller was calling it the arm that wasn't there. The physiotherapy's going well. Your arm's bulked up enough for it to fit. There. Perfect. A little time with it, and it'll work better than the real thing. What do you think? Huh. I can still feel my real arm. Well, you better get used to this one quick. You have any pain? Every now and then. Where? My fingertips. My left fingertips. Uh, sounds like phantom pain. Your brain still remembers your old hand. Yeah. What about your vision? Can you see okay? Yeah, at the moment. Now, the shrapnel in your skull is pressing on your optic nerve. I'm told any hard impact could have an effect on your visual cortex. Yeah, the doctor mentioned that. Your brain might process visual information incorrectly. In other words, you could have hallucinations. You might see things that aren't there and not see things that they really are. You experience any of that? I think so. When? Right after I wake up. Colors look faded. Colors, huh? Well, that's not a major concern in and of itself, but it could mean the difference between life and death in the field. You'll need to watch out for that. I will. All right. You should continue your physio. We'll be arriving soon. It's the last chance you'll get. All right. So that was all the things I. Oh. Ah. Uh, so. I haven't really gone through the that tapes of this game. So I apologize if I kind of just sort of let it go there for a minute, but I don't really, I haven't really pieced through together of this game. I just mostly played it, but uh, now that I kind of understand Metal Gear more because I played all the Metal Gear, well, I have played almost all of them. I played at least the original core games. I haven't played the PSP games yet. You know what? We're going to fly. Okay. Boards. Uh, cool. All right. Um, return to Mother Base. To base. All right, let's go. Heating. 
Come back. Look at this dude. Mix. Here's the dog you brought back. Bit of a troublemaker. Not sure about the breed, though. He'll get bigger. Uh huh. Like this. You know, I can look after him. He's still a pup, so he doesn't listen. I have a feeling someday he'll be useful. Oh, Didi is useful. A real diamond in the rough. With a little polish. I say we got a true diamond dog on our hands. Wow, the, that's the fucking title of the game. Cute dog. Oh, time to get high. <laughs> All right, we're back. <laughs> Yo, what's up, dude? High five. Good talk. All right, man. That was a good talk. You know what? I can play music, right? Uh, fuck. Let's go to my cassette tapes. Whatever supplies you need, boss, let us know, boss. Music tape. Here we go. All right, time to inspect the base. Oh my God, look at my base. We're doing pretty good though, I'm not gonna lie. God damn it, Snake. You just stand there, just look off. Look at your. What's up, dude? Thank you. Letting me join Diamond Dogs. No problem, man. Alright, here you go. Good talk. Damn, this game reminds me of why I remember why I love this game because I can just be a fucking loser But be a badass soldier Now I know why Kojima wanted this game made Kojima your game could have been the greatest It made me a fan It made me a fan. That's all that matters If it wasn't for this game, I'm gonna be straight with you guys if it really if it wasn't for this game I wouldn't honestly know about anything with this game, like the Metal Gear series. I'm not shitting you. Like, this game is so fucking crazy. Like, if it could make me a fan of a, of a 20 plus year old series, you know? I can, you know, it, it can't be all bad. But I think it's just a shame that it wasn't truly completed, you know? I know Konami's got his bullshit and whatnot, but...
Wait a minute, I have to destroy some comms equipment? Okay. Alright, let's go roll in. Let's go roll on some fucking baddies. I'm just kidding. They're just doing their jobs. I'm doing mine. And by that being and by that being the greatest soldier who ever lived. I'm just kidding. I'm not. I'm just a just a dude. Oh my god. Okay, I had some <gasps> Okay, real talk. I had some I shouldn't say real talk. <laughs> what I'm saying is um I had some PTSD Red Dead Redemption moments there where you just fucking slam right into a goddamn wall. No fucks given. Are there cracks in the wall that I can climb up? Enter the Eastern Communications Post and destroy the target equipment. Its location is on your iDroid. Isn't there like cracks in the wall I can climb up? Come on, snake. Find me a crack. God damn it. Ugh. Is this a crack? No. Get it. I do not know how to do things. Hey, look, it's a sheep. Hey, hey. The sheep, I should say. We gotta snag the sheep, folks. There it is. Launch that shit. I wonder if there's any more things I could snag. Who knows? At this point. My horse still over there? Oh my god, Snake, where are you going? I'll tell you where you're going. You're going nowhere. I have to go. Mm, okay. Come on, horse. Where are you? There you are. Come on, diamond horse. We gotta... We gotta... Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, let's go. We got places to go. There you go. They'll never notice. 
There we go. Now we can get back on track. Thought I could take a shortcut, but I couldn't. My exploration did not pay off. No, I feel taking the main road. Oh, I should go this way. Good job. Oh, smart horse. This is why this game is the best, because everything is smart for you. All right, tell me which direction I... Oh, my God. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, that was a double whammy. Yeah, buddy. Um, get your face. All right, buddy. Asta. At least you'll be quiet. Trampled. Oh, I can't. That guy died. That guy's fucking dead. <laughs> you have arrived at you made it. First, use the binoculars to locate the communications equipment at the facility. Oh, I see it. I got a better idea, Snips. Man, look at the gleam on that fucking gun. The way it just seems. It's just nice. I just remember how nice this game was. I played it a lot. When this game come out in 2014, 2015? Weapons and equipment. Take a look at the plants list on your iDroid to see which ones we need. Then go find them if you get the chance. It'll keep the staff happy too. All right, so my main goal right now <laughs> is to sneak in and find their comms equipment, which I think is in this building right here. I want to say it is, but I also don't believe it is, you know. Oh, shit. Somebody sees me. Bye. That guy's family is not going home. Neither is this guy's. Both of them. They're both dead. And... This is where I make a little bit of a commotion. Alright. Uh... You know what? guys if you have to shoot be careful come on guys they don't even know where I am they don't even know what I look like Oh, watch. Now I'm going to shut the power off. Bike. Oh, 
Oh. Hiding in plain sight, folks. Really? This guy... This guy thinks he's so goddamn smart. Okay. Oh, he's... We're raising the roof. Wait, what is you doing, Snake? Oh my god. Snake! Why are you raising the roof? Snake! Snake, it is no time to throw a party. Oh my god. You motherfucker. Yeah, you stay down. You know who had that happen to? Yourself. Ooh, there's a radio. I'm taking that. This is my tape. This is my tape now. And my propaganda. And oh look at that. Yeah, fuck your hot zone. Here. Okay. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Oh, I'm running. Get in the car, snake. <laughs> Step on it. And that is the snake's great escape. Oh my god, I almost died. <laughs> oh, the snake's great escapes. Wait. We did it, guys. Is that my truck now, too? Hell yeah. Mission complete. Great work. Look at that. Wasn't a good run, but... We could do better next time. And we will do better next time. I just thought it was funny how I just literally <laughs> murdered everyone and they're like, what the fuck? <laughs> they were literally like hoblob and died. What happened to the mother base me members? They all died. Growing like crazy thanks to you, boss. Oh man, fact, it's getting downright crowded around here. To bring a greater number of people on board, we'll need to expand our facilities. To that end, I've created a base development unit. It has two roles material refinement and platform construction. I'll start with the material refinement part. The base development unit procures material resources on a regular basis according to its level. The materials are stored in containers and placed on the deck of Mother Base. Once they're finished being processed, they can finally be put to use. By using these materials to build new platforms, we'll be able to add a greater number of staff to our ranks. We don't need any specific instructions from you to refine the materials, but I want you to be the one to decide how we construct platforms. Once we have sufficient GMP and the required material resources, you can issue construction orders from your iDroid. Okay, so... And just issue that as a thing. If I'm not mistaken. Look at this dude. Sad dude. 
He's sad because he's named Pirate Buffalo. Why didn't these guys get higher? Why didn't Cunning Eagle get a higher up? He's a level B in He's a level B integrate and now and he's just getting shit canned. Because is it because he's a minority? That's sad. This game, I thought it was breaking boundaries. That of Afghanistan. It's a difficult mission. But I'd say you're back in top form by now. Check your iDroid for the details. All right. So that's my truck now, but I'm just going to keep it there. Where's my horse? The There you are. All right, time to have fun. Challenge tasks? Okay. Perform 100 total markings. Okay. Uh, yeah, we can start doing these, I guess. So I can kill time. And perform 10 total takedowns. Well, I've got to be doing these anyway. Um... Can I do anything still? Staff management, base faculties. I can build base stuff now, finally. Hell yeah, here we go. So, I'm going to improve our... R&D. Yes. It's gonna take an hour? Okay. I'm okay with that. Oh man, it's getting rainy. Okay, um... Missions. Please select a mission. mission accepted. Oh my god. Ah! I'm in a sandstorm. Darude. Even my horse is mad. Jesus Christ, where am I going? At least this isn't like in Mad Max, where the fucking sandstorm just eats your butthole all fucking day. Well... How far away is it? Uh. Okay, we're going there. All right, let's ride. You know what I see this as a time for? You know, I see me. Hold on, you know what? Hold, hold on. Oh, is that another sheep? another sh okay hold on a second i'm gonna see if i can um hmm um here i'm gonna go to my band camp i'm gonna go right here and i'm just gonna play um Like, lower the volume in this game? I don't know. I just go to sound settings and it doesn't give you much. But, nah, it won't work. It won't link up well with the thing, so it's fine. I can just keep playing this. I was gonna play some vapor music, but I feel the music, the game will just get in the way of it, you know? It'll just be a garbled mess. Let's go. We're coming up on this one. 
Oh, eat your heart out, fucking Red Dead horse. This is why I had a, such a bad time riding the horse in Red Dead. It's because in Metal Gear, this horse ate fucking stones to fucking run the way it's going. It's hauling ass. But we're coming up to the base. Listen, horse buddy. I don't want you to get hurt. So I'm going to let you slide right there. But you know what I'm not going to do? I'm going to get a vantage point up here. And we're going to... We're going to mess with everyone for a little bit. The, the crow? That ain't... That ain't... That ain't it. Got it. Oh, it's on the other side. Okay. Oh, we extracted it. Okay, so we need to break into this gate. So I need to get into this place. Um... How am I gonna do this? Uh, um, where's my sniper rifle? <laughs> First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna look at everything that I can get. Um, there's another guy. There's another guy. Sure, there are more people, but... You know what? It's a shame. It's a shame that all of these people who are just doing their jobs. Ah. Uh, this guy especially. Oh, and I missed. Extraction arrived at Mother Base. This guy, this is the guy that's talking. This guy better cover his fucking head. Ooh. Mother Fox. You shouldn't be a still image like that. <laughs> oh, I should have hit the thing. Oh, wow. That's not going to do you any good. Listen, buddies. Ooh. Oh, I need that plant. Damn right you lost eyes on the enemy.
getting sneaky. What are you doing? There must be a flare. Alright, buddy. Uh, all right, cool. Good talk. That was a very good talk. Hey guys, guess what? Oh my God, no way. Oh my god! Am I even gonna hit one of them? Oh my god, it is raining hellfire down on those guys. Oh, I got one. Oh, I got him. I got him. Mortar is actually really useful in this. Any more that want to fuck with this? Or is there anything else that I can just kind of mess up? Doubt that'll do anything. Yeah, I won't. Okay, good talk. No! Oh, yeah, that was kind of morbid. I kicked him, well, woke him up, and then. It just did a little break dance. <laughs> oh, that's morbid. Guess what? You can do it in this game. Alright, where are those gosh darn blueprints? They're right there. Oh, let's go get them. Grabbed. Grabbed. Actually, you know what? I got something better. All right. Doodles.
That's what I want. Okay. So... I want to head over here. <gasps> Is there a truck rolling through? Uh-oh. There is a truck rolling through. Oh. Oh, you can't see me. Fucking John Cena up in this bitch. Now you can. Where's the other guy? Too bad no one came. Yikes. Where is it going? Hey, Speed. Happy to see you're streaming the classic again. Are you going to get Death Stranding when it comes out? Most likely. I mean, it looks pretty fun. Why am I going over there? The blueprints are over here, Snake. Why are you running away? But it is good to see you, Scuba. How are you doing, man? I'm doing pretty good. I'm happy I'm streaming again, so... And I am streaming the classic. Wait a minute. This isn't... Where are the blueprints? Oh, they're right here. God damn. Dude, remember remember when I played this game so much? Elsa, is that Brandon? That's a classic Brandon meme right there. Is it in here? There it is. Good, good job, Snake. You're doing your job. Yeah, they can't even respond because I murdered them all. I don't know who's left standing right now, but whoever he is, he's, he's lucky he didn't see me. I wonder where he is. Oh, well, we're just going to leave. Not after I raid some more shit. Of course. Gonna raid that. That's mine. Dude, I remember when you were first playing this game on the PS4 and I was just blown away at how awesome it looked. And I never even played a Metal Gear game. I was actually talking about how much fun I actually had playing this game. I remember this game being huge for me getting back into, um... Or actually huge. This was a huge influence for me on Metal Gear as a whole. I love this game. I think, um, I think what got me into it the most was just how freaking smooth and free you can play in this game. Speaking of, have you even completed this game, Steve? I'm just curious, because I remember you were playing it, and then I played it, and I just took over. I just basically plowed through this game like a, like a, like a fucking sloppy third prom date, you know? Now I gotta figure out, here, we're gonna drive. No sign of the enemy. <laughs> I'm sure he's nowhere to be found. Let's get the highly trilled soldier. Trilling. Did I pull out a tire? Oh, we're good. Fuck. No. Shit. Yeah, they can't even respond. They're like, what the fuck happened to this base? And then there was a truck missing. Man, we are just owning the crap out of... Oh my god, sheep, move out of the way. Can I honk the horn? Oh, there it goes around. 
back to the wild. Drunk. Sorry. Drunk driving. I'm sorry, guys. I'm just driving through. You know, you guys gotta make these streets more accessible. It's kind of funny that they just immediately just are like, oh yeah, you're not Snake. Even though I'm driving in their trucks. I'm driving in their vehicles and they still don't recognize me. Their own flesh and blood. Oh, handbrake that. Oh, give it some initial D. Give it that initial E. Because that's where I'm going. We're just taking a drive up the country, you know? Drive up the country to fucking Egypt or someplace. We're in Afghanistan, for Christ's sake. Ooh, that's gonna be a fun drive. We're gonna just drive through that. Excuse me, guys. I'm driving. Yeah, I know. Wow, that went a lot smoother than I thought. Extract the highly skilled soldier. Din -din 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 -din. <laughs> yeah, that was and he died and was never seen again. I am the ultimate soldier. The soul. Oh, get down. fuck! The enemy sniper. Stay low and crawl along the ground. That should enable you to sneak past enemies. Hey, baby. Ooh, there's two of you. Nice sniper. A hey, nice bike. Motherfucker, I thought it would do the zoom thing. Like, do you think you got the moves? Bitch, I can see you. I know where your family lives. You think I'm afraid of that? You think I'm afraid of some shitty sniper? I freaking live and breathe that. I'm gonna rise. Oh, this is gonna be so pretty. This is gonna look so good after I murder all of these people. Ah, <laughs> uh, we're waking up on a beautiful Monday morning. You know, I take my jogs really early because, you know, you know, I take my jogs so early because it's the perfect time of the day to get the morning rush, you know. You know, of course, I go in my military gear. And of course, you know, the locals always give me trouble. Side ops list. Like this guy. You see that deer stand up there? You see, I'm not really a fan of you know him building that there because well you know you know is he even up there i don't even think he's up there uh can i look at it come on oh shit See, these guys there are some people that i think are going to be pulling up here for a second are they right behind me? I don't know. Point is, this guy right here. Is there a guy up there? No. Of course not. Of course. He builds it and he doesn't even attend it. This guy right here. You know. Hold on. Let's get this guy. Ha 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 ha. 
<laughs> oh, I'm sorry. It's just, it gets so much, it's such a fun game. I'm sorry. And then I just put fucking like, they freak out. Oh, that guy's dead. <sighs> We're making good contact. Is that supposed to be a bridge? Is this supposed to be a bridge? <laughs> Good. Alright, so... I'm in the area, I'm supposed to... Mission start point. Okay. Um... What am I exactly doing? So a sandstorm's come in. Sandstorms effectively make you blind and deaf. And that goes for the enemy too. The Where's the other guy? I can't see him. I can't see this guy. Where is he? I don't know. I don't know where this guy is. Oh. Damn it, I need to save one of these guys. to figure out who the soldier is. Great. <laughs> oh, I just knocked him out. Well, I'll be damned. You're lucky I didn't kill you. You are very lucky I didn't kill you. Was that the guy? Oh, he's over here. My bad. Alright, elite guy. Ooh, you, you got... Buddy. Here he comes. Hey, buddy, look up. 
Yeah, yeah, he was like, oh, I didn't know what I'm looking at. What is that? He's pointing a gun at me? <laughs> Alright. Alright, where is this guy? Right here. Oh my god. Like that. See that guy. See that guy's freaking out just a little bit. Not a whole lot, but just enough. talk this guy's in a panic mode right now you gotta kind of have him come to you he's coming right towards me I don't even have to move surprise Is that the mission? All right. Ah, oh, let's get out of this joint. Let's get out of there. All right, Snake, let's drive. Let's drive where no boy has ever gone before. start point all right let's drive to our mission start point fellers east bound and down let's go taking the scenic route guys what's up soy what's up soy boy oh buddy you're gonna have to finish that some other time How do you not see me? Ah, oh, man, I'm so sorry. Uh. Here, guy. Here, guy. You no, know, I don't know if I can pick you up. Way you are right now. Um if he's on the brink of death, it's hard to say whether he'll survive a Fulton extraction. If you have to extract oh, he dead. On the brink of death, you better use the chopper. But if you're gonna carry them, put him to sleep first. You won't get far if you have to fight them every step. Oh, he died. It's okay. It's okay, Oshawat. Poor guy. Now I'm back to my jog, you know. Kind of took out someone else's deer post, bud. You know, I like doing these walks because I get sometimes my uh, my plants. 
which is useful. You can take a break, Snake. You're looking a little dirty. my mortal enemy my mortal enemy of combat all right let's get back to boot scooting boogieing well that looks a lot closer so let's see where that leads close can you power climb there it is my destination Oh, we're getting good soldiers now. bear <coughs> that's the Waxin barracks the target is somewhere inside that outpost the Soviets consider him a traitor now so he'll be treated like any other prisoner yeah yeah um, so I see a way I can get in eventually. Um, I just want to freak people out just a bit. That's eh, fine. I know which way I'll go. I know which way to go.
yeah, that wasn't a good... Yeah, you're dumb. <laughs> uh, do you see this guy right here? Um, can I get a... Can I get a fucking order round here? Uh, I don't got a good enough shot. Um, how about up there? Can I time this right? Okay, okay, hold on. Going prone. We're taking a very risky shot. Damn it. So your suppressor is worn out. Yeah, I know. You'll be as loud as any other now. God damn it. That'll get him. My ass is a combat position. <laughs> Watch this guy. <laughs> like that. I'm in the middle of their goddamn streets. Ooh, Peter. Come on. Ah, come on. dude yeah I wouldn't be standing behind that <laughs> oh yeah so sad it's so satisfying I don't know why but in this game this is the only game like Grand Theft Auto is fun and all but this game I just like being tactical with my shit you know dead I'm busting in this way. Yeah, I know where the guy is, so I'm not too, you know hung up on where to extract them but I also know that this guy Ooh, did I hit his gun oh my god wait what happened there Mother. What? Fuck. Shit.
Get it. God damn it. Good. You destroyed their anti air radar? It wasn't one of the targets, but that's put a hole in their air surveillance. The chopper will be. Well, that would have been dead. Now. You can designate a landing zone near the outpost. God damn. Okay. All right, we're calling in. We're calling in air support. Please select a strike point. Support helicopter. I want to have air. I want an air strike. Damn it. Fuck. Huh. Oh, here comes some freedom. Where is the freedom? Well, there's a sandstorm coming. Yeah, I actually always played this game sneakily, but I, I'm glad that I can play it like, you know, just run and shoot. Here, you know what, buddy? Here, I'm picking you up. You're coming with me, buddy. Quit moving. Good. Damn right you've arrived. Support helicopter has arrived. Hope this guy's still alive. That's one dude. Hope that other guy is still alive. Oh. oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, we're doing good. Where the hell? So the guy is in here somewhere. Uh, I'm just kind of stealing whatever I can steal. So I think there's a diamond right here. Yeah. Yeah, I see it. I'm just raiding everything right now. Blueprints.
Okay, I hope I, I just don't want my helicopter to fly off. I'd be super mad. I'm confused. This isn't a retro Nintendo game. You're right, V. It's a good game. It's a game that I think gets a lot of shit for not being that bad. It's really good. I just think it gets shit for not being finished. But hello, V. How are you? I'm doing very good. I'm just trying to figure out this freaking maze. Oh, I know what I can do here. Good. I'm just stealing shit. I just murdered an entire group of people. Where's the dude? Where the gold at? Where the gold at? Oh, got a tape. Afghan lullaby. Oh, here he is. Break him out. What's up, baby? All right, homie. We're extracting you. We're dipping. Have you ever played this game, V? Or have you ever played a Metal Gear game? Because this was the first Metal Gear game I ever played. Oh, is there trouble? Oh, that guy's shooting me. <laughs> uh, nope. Nope. I played the first one on the PS1. Yeah, that's one of, that's a really good one. It's a classic. Like, I personally enjoy that game. Um, I think that was the second Metal Gear game I ever played. I have a, it's weird, so... I don't want to say it's like nostalgic memories, but... I remember playing, I remember there was a point where I was playing that game a lot. And what I felt was even funnier was... I was playing that game at night, too. That was when I was working a lot of, uh... That was when I was working a lot of driving shifts at night, you know, back at Jimmy John's. And when I worked that, I would be playing like Metal Gear Solid 1, and then I was playing Metal Gear Solid 3, and then I found Metal Gear Solid 2, but then I was replaying. Man, you know, just replaying Metal Gear Solid 1, I, I want to just replay it at night because uh, one of my first really big streams that I had. Oh, hold on, story. Okay, yeah, it's just them talking. Anyway, but when I first played this game, or when I first played uh, Metal Gear Solid 1, I was playing a lot of it at night, like a lot of it, and it was so much fun. It's very, I have a lot of memories with that. I don't know. It's just, I know it happened only a couple of years ago, but I just, I remember doing that quite a bit, and it was a lot of fun. I think that's where my basis love for Metal Gear started. And I have four. I have all of the Metal Gear games. I have one I have one through five. And uh four was the last one because I didn't have a PS3, but now I do and I play it, so I guess I just I don't know. I guess I just really like it. I just wanna play it normally, but I still can't figure out two. Like Metal Gear 2 is weird.
Where am I going? Here, let's listen to another uh, tape recording. Ocelot briefing. Ocelot. I hear they started calling you Shalashaska in Afghanistan. What's that about? <laughs> you know the term Sharashka? It's slang for a suspicious, hastily thrown together organization. The word became associated with a type of forced labor facility in the Soviet Gulag system. OKB scientists and engineers who'd been convicted of crimes were sent to a Sharashka for forced R&D. The Sharashkas were supervised by Lavrenti Berea of the NKVD, the secret police, under the official name, 4th Special Department. Forced research? That's not very different from what we do here. <laughs> Diamond Dogs is different. Everyone here believes in you. Regardless of where they came from or why they're here, they revere you. And they're fighting because it was their choice. And if it wasn't, they'd leave? Who knows? That's our reality here, whether it's real or not. If there's another truth, I don't want to know it. All that matters is that's the concept that's taken shape in their heads. The traces of a group ideology, our superstructure, to put it in Marx's terms. All right. Go on. Right. So anyway, at some point the enemy started calling me Sharashka. This was after the war in Afghanistan broke out. While I was keeping an eye on you in that hospital, I was also heading up interrogations here. The men I broke gave up their comrades and families everything they wanted to protect the most. No real cause for it. I just let myself get caught up in the old Russian pride. And suddenly I received the honor of becoming special interrogation advisor to the forced labor camps. But the more men I interrogated, the more people saw me as just that, the interrogator. It helped cover my real objective of keeping you safe. He went that far for me. Far enough to keep you alive. That's cute. I ended up being pretty well known among the Afghan guerrillas. Some of them would have seen me on the battlefield. And that's how I got the second half of the name. Shashka. It's a sword. A type of saber from the Caucasus. Russian dragoons and Cossacks carry them into battle. Now the Russian Empire had a general by the name of Fyodor Artorovich Keller. His bravery earned him the nickname Russia's Greatest Shashka. Someone must have known about that. Because somewhere along the line, Shashka got stuck on the end of Sharashka. The guerrillas were using the name amongst themselves. By the time I got to hearing about it, the pronunciation had wound up as Shalashashka. So half gulag, half hero sword. It was a perfect fit. But you see how rumors and ideas about people can get out of hand fast. Once you create a character and put it out there in public mind, it warps and twists with every baseless rumor. And before you know it, all people see are phantoms. In my case, it works out just fine. I'm plenty used to working under aliases. Well then. Yes, it is cool that I have all five. I I really wanted to play all five as what they're supposed to be intended. I want to try and get, you know, five on PS4 so then I could have them all on the PlayStation. And, you know, it'd be fine, but... All right. Yeah, a lot of these briefings take like 80 million years to brief. So, another thing, I know I keep mentioning this, but I'm really glad that my wired connection isn't cutting out my signal. I could probably boost up the graphics if that's the case, which if I can, that'd be awesome. Um, in my personal opinion of the Metal Gear games, I think one is a classic, <laughs> five is a personal favorite, but in hindsight, um, I think three, I think a lot of people say three is the best one, which I can agree, but I'm like cutting a mix between like three and one. Cause one is like just perfect. It's like every, it's not too much. It's not too little. It gives you the right amount that makes you want to play more. If that makes sense. Like, cause I, I actually have played through that game all at once and I didn't even intend to, it's just that fun of a game, but three is like you gotta think a lot more and maybe it's just i don't like thinking as much but then there's games like this where i just get caught in it and it's just easy but like fun at the same time i don't know i'm just weird like that it's a good game it's unfinished unfortunately but it, 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 it i think what people are more mad about 
is that there's so much potential in this game. There's so much things, and I think that's why people really want to see Death Stranding. You know, the new Kojima game that's coming out very soon. I don't know. Uh. I'm trying to think if I want to start another mission or if I want to like kind of play another small game for the last couple of minutes. Uh, let me. Let's see. Fuck okay, it, let's go to, uh, let's close this. Let's, uh, let's. The puppy's training is going well. There'll come a day when he'll be ready to join you on missions. But you know, he, uh, he gets lonely easily. Yes. Uh, right. Yes, let's... All right, so that was fun. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna switch it to another game. I had a lot of I have a lot of fun. I forget how much fun it is, but I also forget how fucking long this game is. But we are going to go to bastard. Game. Edit. Right. There it is. Done. Okay. And let's play. Sorry about that. Uh, doing. There it goes. Is my voice still good, or does it need to be lowered more? I don't know, V. But to the breach. All right. So we're gonna do a new game. And what are we going to name this ship? We're going to rename it to The Salty Dog. There we go. <laughs> I don't know where that name came from. It's just the name. And we're going to add our homies. Uh, this is going to be me. Uh, Speed Mobile. All right, and then we're gonna have you be Scoey. There we go. And we will add, uh, who else are we gonna add? Well, Scuba Steve was in here, so Scuba Steve, we'll add him. So these are the people that are on our crew. Uh normal you know we're gonna just do an easy just so i can get an understanding because last time i keep dying so uh layout i do oh i can only do that okay all right mystical baloney i already named it the salty dog so all right let's go the data you carry is a vital to remaining. Yeah, I know, I know. Continue. All right, uh, jump to distress signal. Let's go. 
You arrive at the beacon and immediately detect a pirate ship. It seems the distress beacon was a trap. Oh, shit. Uh. Uh. Shit. All right, you win. Here's some equipment from our stores. Leave us alone. Accept the offer. Sure. Nice. Uh, the stress beacon is coming from a civilian ship. It appears to be being chased by a pirate. Aid the civilian ship. That and the laser bursts at the freaking things. Uh, oh, we got it. The pirate ship breaks apart. You hasten contact the civilian ship. Nice. Civilian ship wisely made a fast retreat while you distracted the hostile ship. Nice. Those are the engines. Um, I can turn. Can I turn this off? There we go. Okay, there we go. Alright, I can jump here. Uh, this beacon has been placed too close to a super giant class M star. The ship will gradually overheat until you get out of here or die. A pirate ship apparently oblivious to danger and moves to engage. Great. Uh. Uh. Shoot. Come on. Ain't looking good. Shoot. Ah. Uh oh. Fuck. Oh no, we're all gonna die. Why is it being put out? Oh no! The shit! <laughs> ah! Oh no, we're all gonna die. V! No, you're gonna- No! V! Oh, you gotta send an email. Oh, shit. You stopped it right before it could- Okay, you need to go- <laughs> As- <sighs> Alright. We're doing it again. <sighs> All right, let's go. We're going to the store. The space station was here. It was traveling merchant who shows you. Okay, drone control. I only have 30. Come on. Okay. Um Okay, there we go. There we go. Okay. Okay. Jump to here. B, I'm sorry I let you down again. 
You stumble across a forward scout of a rebel fleet. What? Okay, um, continue. They're powering up their FTL. If they get away, they'll probably no doubt warn the fleet of your position. Uh, open fire. No, that's a bad move. Okay. Fire. Fire. Shit, what am I doing? Why isn't he putting out the fire? It got away! Shit, 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 shit. You're dying. Oh, you're dying, but it's okay. We're turning this off. Turn that back on. Jump. Get the hell out of there. I'm used to you letting me down. I'm used... You see a number of... Uh-oh. Great. Oh, no! Fight them. Fight these guys. Fight these guys. We're on the same turf. Beat them up. We're good. We're good. See, look at that. We're back on track. And now we're ready to jump on out of here. You come out of the ship to see laser blasts coming from the other side of the beacon. It looks like someone is under attack from a tide. Aid the ship. Let's go. Uh, fire. Damn it. you putting out the fire okay come on guys shit come on guys Fix it up and fire. Fire. Ah! Nice. Alright, so we're repairing that. Uba, you need to get ready. And then send you there. There's a distress signal. What's going on? There's trouble afoot. You find a number of ships fleeing from a small space station. You hail them. Asking, what's wrong? Help, we're being overrun by some sort of giant alien spiders. Send the crew to help. No! No! I'm dead! I'm the captain! I can't die! 
Your crew boards the station, cautiously moving between the corridors. Suddenly, a man-sized arachnid bursts from a vent in the ceiling, followed by countless more. You fight your way back to the airlock and are forced to leave before accounting for all crew members. Not everyone made it back. Speed Mobile is gone. I'm the captain! <laughs> so we don't have a person. Great. Great. I hate everything. I hate... There's another distress signal. Yeah, those people can just die. Those people can just rot in a hole. Oh my god. I'm in the land of fucking fruity frosted pebbles. Fucking cocoa pebbles. A pirate ship was lying in wake. Oh no. I didn't plan for this. Son of a bitch. You wanna go? Wanna freaking go? Get him. The enemy shit should be fear firing up. Yeah, no, keep firing. Keep firing. Fire. Ah. Oh. Yeah, we need to get. We need to get out of here. We need to get. Fuck. Come on. Jump. Get out of here. Okay, you've arrived in the long range beacon. You see a small station. Repair 20 damage. Alright, uh, we're just gonna open all of these. Good. Great. Oh, that ain't good. All right, let's get that oxygen. Scuba, why are you dying? Scuba! What's open? What? Oh, that's bullshit. I don't know. That shouldn't have happened. Lost another guy, folks. Okay, we need to we need to repair this. I wish I had more people. Oh no. Okay. So that the lights are on. Well, V, it looks like you are the captain of the ship once again. See, everything went downhill once I died. As it should be. <laughs> you are a more prideful man. You are a more humble man, I should say. Than I'll ever be. Here, let's jump. All right, next. You know what? Cancel. We're just gonna chill. Get our shields back up. All right. Uh, wait, cancel. What is this? Get out of there. All right, next sector. We're going down here. We're going down. 
few years ago this region was busting with trade activity now it's overrun with bandits and marauder marauders you should tread lightly here i don't give a damn i'll survive Gump. hey a distress signal i bet it's trouble as you arrive oh called it get in there I was gonna say, I hope that guy doesn't start firing at me. like there's just going to be trouble everywhere I go and especially well-armed spaceship approach you and over one of your crew members but there's only one of us left <laughs> could have beat that but I just wondered what would happen, to be honest. I was hoping they'd be like, there are no people, and then I would have to fight anyway. Alright, we're back. We're back in the fray once again. Alright, where are we jumping to? You, you jump into a field of debris. It appears a battle recently took place here. The loser seems to have been a civilian ship. A message was left to free. Rebels attacking, please send aid. The responsible rebels are still likely nearby. Yeah, let's fuck them up. Uh. Shoot them. They're trying to stop it. Nice. The ship explodes. Nice. Got a drone part too. John Caldwell. I don't know, Maxwell the Mantis. I'm one short. Can I sell something? Nothing to sell. I'll buy that. Alright, so you get to work on the shields. You, speed, you get to go work on the engines. We'll jump to that distress signal. You find a number of ships fleeing from a small space station. You hail them, asking, what's wrong? Help, we're being overrun by some sort of giant alien spiders. Yeah, we're gonna leave them alone. 
Toodles. <laughs> yeah, I'm not. I'm learning from my mistake. Scans reveal a large asteroid field nearby. Short range scanners may discover useful materials while we wait for the FTL to recharge. Explore the asteroid field. It's too dangerous. We'll just wait for the FTL to charge. Yeah. I ain't going in there. You find the source of the distress call, a small research station. It appears a small laboratory fire got out of control and is threatening to destroy the station. Their fire suppression system is not responding. Yeah, help put out the fire. Your crew valiantly keeps the fire at bay long enough for the some scientists to escape, but it appears to be losing battle. Before long, you order the retreat. A few scientists that we're able to save are distraught but grateful. You'll drop them off at the nearest station. An especially well-armed pirate ship approaches you and over one of your crew members will ne no I'm not going to fuck these fuck these guys Shit, they gave us one of theirs? Oh man, we're doing so good today. Look it, we've got a whole crew. Uh, is there another place he can work at? I'll just have him work in here. Sure. Jump. Um, we're doing pretty good. We got a whole crew of people. A ship was with conspicuous pirate markings is orbiting a nearby moon, broadcasting a simple message claiming to have equipment available for sale. Yeah, hail that shit. We have taken extensive stock. Come aboard and see our wares. Dock with the ship. What kind of issue? Buy some drone parts. Uh, I wish I could. Sure, why not? Make anything with this? I don't know. Continue. Accept. Um, jump. Jump here. V, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this. An especially well-armed... No! I will never fucking surrender. Oh shit, I can see their ship. That's awesome. Yeah. Accept it. Accept that. Look at this. We've got more people. More people doing more things. Man, we have a whole gosh darn crew of people. Where are you, V? You need to go to the hospital bay. What's wrong, V? Why are you sad? About a rebel it seems to have been refitted for transport rather than combat. Demand a surrender of their goods. Uh.
Uh oh, that's not good. We're losing oxygen. Damn it. Not strong enough. It's just a flesh wound. You've got you've arrived at the long range, yes. Um Okay. Um All right, we all looking good. I'm not looking good. I should go over there. Oh, we're going to Uncharted Nebula. Yeah, you know me. I I navigate on instinct all the time. Vector beset a plasma storm and an automated what? Come on. Damn it. Uh, I don't have any weapons. Shoot. Ah, uh, fuck. Leave me alone. Ah. I have no money. Fix that. Ah, uh, fix that too. Ah. Uh, just keep fixing shit. Oh, no. B, this is how we're going to die. Hole is at 50%. Fuck. Shit. Shit. How am I... I don't... I don't have... Oh, I need oxygen. Shit. Oh, my God. Okay, okay, team. Keep pumping power to that. Ah. Uh, shit. We're gonna die if this keeps going. Ah. Uh, Come on, keep charging, baby. Oh, uh, fuck. Come on, jump. Get me out of here. <laughs> uh, without knowing where it is, all you can do is wait for your FTL to charge. Good. Here's my shield. There's my weapon. Jump. I just need to leave. A pirate ship. Yeah, we need to stay away from anything right now. We need to get out of dodge. See a small, ignore it. I don't care right now. We need to get the hell out of here right now. Jump. Uh, hey, there's a store. <laughs> Can you? Drone control. Can I sell anything? No. 
How much would you buy that? For 19, it's going to be enough. Mm, man, I don't even have enough money. Oh, I don't even... <sighs> Guess that'll be it. Actually... I'm just trying to see if I can find anything in a plasma storm manually search the wreckage oh among the junk you find yeah a salvageable drone schematic let's go and with that I can pay for my ship to get repaired hot damn Or at least a good chunk of it. But I also have a drone schematic. Wait, you... Uh... Can I... Cargo, boarding. Okay. Oh, I guess I can just board other ships. That's kind of... Where are you... There you are. Go to the hospital. You're going to the hospital, V. Roper. Grace. Roper Grace. You go here, too. There. You there. You... Here and now we need to jump. Uh oh. Uh oh. That wasn't smart. Uh. Uh oh. So do I just wait? Uh oh. <laughs> That was a bad move, guys. And this is why I'm not an astronaut. Alright, let's go. Laser blast them. Alright.
Uh, can I throw something at him? Ah, oh, fuck. Yeah, we're we're in kind of dunzo territory, aren't we? Can't even get this running. Uh-oh, we're out of oxygen now, too. Shit! We're losing the posse. Who would have thought it would have ended this bad? Uh-oh. Whoa! Well, I guess that's what we call my wonderful playing skills with this game. I'm doing a really bad job, aren't I? <laughs> Alright, well, had a lot of fun playing that. Hope you guys had a lot of fun. Um, wait a minute, did I get a new follower? Mazranti, Mazranti, if you're in here still, thank you for following. I don't know why my notification things aren't working. I think I'm gonna have to just re, like, reinstall it and all that shit. So, uh, thank you for the follow. Um, again, uh, thank you for watching. I'm glad I'm getting more back on track. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this sort of half and half Metal Gear and, um, Faster than light stream. I enjoyed it. I had a lot of fun. So on that note, um, I'll see you guys some other time. Uh, most likely be playing something tomorrow. Maybe. I'm not sure yet, but I most likely will. I have it set in the schedule. So anyway, let's pop it over to uh, here. There it goes. And we will just call her quits for the evening. So, close that. Close that. Um, pop this up. Yeah, I'm glad that my first PC, um, <laughs> my first PC on line stream kind of went well. Um, yeah. Uh, see you guys next time, and hope you guys, <laughs> hope you guys have a lot of fun. All right. Later. GB Keku Army.